starting my day off in the office this morning. I have very little time, so I am enjoying a rare treat of a bowl of organic peanut butter puffs. I rarely have cereal, so when I do, this is my go-to, and I'm just having a little unsweetened almond milk to top it off. Well, my bestie's 40th birthday brunch went off without a hitch. Here we are cleaning up, actually, and we've put all the sweets away, so this is just a sampling of what I ate, which was way too much salami, way too much gouda, way too much artichoke dip and gluten-free crackers, and multiple pieces of gluten-free cake. Hopping now with said bestie, and she has grabbed us some kombucha. Well, my brunch went off without a hitch, but I had no dinner plan, which is so rare in my household. I am usually the woman with a plan, but I found these Birch Benders pancake and waffle mix. It's paleo with beautiful clean ingredients, no refined flours or sugar of any kind, which is so rare. Um, so I'm gonna whip up some breakfast for dinner. The turkey bacon and the pork bacon are both paleo, clean and nitrate free and uncured. Um, but to top it all off, we're going to add some hash brown patties, which is such a rare treat in this household. Most of those hash brown patties you find in the supermarket have flour in them. These do not, um, but they have way too many ingredients to be clean, but they are non-GMO and no preservatives. peek at those packages of uncured turkey bacon and pork bacon from Trader Joe's. Pancakes, you just technically need the water and the mix, but I added a little avocado oil for consistency. It's a peek at the consistency. It's got a beautiful sheen. It's nice and smooth, not gritty at all, and really great for a paleo pancake. I was just so excited to watch it bubble like a real pancake. I'm not gonna lie, this was very expensive. I got it at Target, it was $10 for the bag, but they now sell it at Costco. So I'm really excited to be able to treat my family to this more often. And here's just a peek at the finished pancake. It's got a really nice golden crust on the top, but it did cook all the way through, not gummy or chewy at all. Here's my paleo pancake with a little bit of the Earth's Best olive oil spread and some pure maple syrup, a couple of pieces of uncured nitrate-free turkey bacon, but just a good old-fashioned hash brown patty. Although I will say there aren't any starches or fillers of any kind, and it is non-GMO and um, no artificial flavors or colors.